So I think it's fair to say at this point that Belichick didn't like going 7-9. and nine. The Patriots are signing everyone. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, DSD, and we're here with another edition of our YouTube. We're going to start our guns blazing today. Before we start, though, make sure you subscribe down below. It would mean a lot. Leave a like, leave a comment. Trying to grow the channel. I've been posting every single day, and I hopefully you guys have liked it. And if you're new here, just subscribe, because... I post a lot. If you like sports, I talk about sports. Let's get into it. The Patriots have literally signed everyone on the market. It's like Oprah. She's like, you get money. You get money. Bill Belichick just handing out money. He's backing up the Brinks truck for everyone. This guy's literally signing everyone. He was so mad that Tom Brady won the Super Bowl. Now he's coming out just signing everyone. I made a video. I made a video saying that the Patriots are going to come out guns blazing in the free agency. Such a softy, I didn't post it because I was concerned when they signed Cam Newton. I was like, they're not going to do anything. Cam Newton shouldn't be on the Patriots. I was super upset and I didn't post it. It would have been awesome. I would have been right. I was right this whole time. Bill Belichick was so upset that Tom Brady just beat him in the Super Bowl. The Patriots didn't make the playoffs. And then the Buccaneers won the Super Bowl. I'm telling you right now that Tom Brady and Bill Belichick are not very different. They are fueled on competition, drive, and proving you wrong. And I, I would be stunned at this point if the Patriots aren't at least in the playoffs next year. They are super aggressive. It has me thinking, is it possible that Belichick was on the hot seat? This is why he did all these big signings? He is signing like I've never seen him sign before. He's literally signing everyone. Let's go over who have they gotten so far. I'm going to butcher some of these names. I don't even care. I'm so happy. As a Patriots fan, this is a great day. Okay, so first... The Patriots trade for Trent Brown, re-sign Cam Newton, sign Matthew Judon, sign Hunter Henry, sign Jonu Smith. So those two right there are crazy because you went from having nobody last year to two studly tight ends out of nowhere. The only issue with Hunter Henry is he's got injury -ish concerns, but man, I love it. And they signed Nelson Aguilar and Kendrick Bourne, two wide receivers. The Patriots number one receiver last year was probably Jacoby Myers or Nikhil Harry, which is hard to believe, but it was definitely, actually definitely Jacoby. Jacoby Myers. Jacoby Myers, as of today, is the third best receiver on the Patriots. That's how bad the Patriots were last year. So I give him a lot of credit for even going 7-9 and because they might have had the worst roster in, I don't know, football last year. They signed David, David God Chalk, I don't, I don't know how to say his name, Jalen Mills, signed Henry Anderson, re-signed Dietrich Wise, and they get Dante Hightower and Patrick Chung back. Guys, the Patriots could be nasty next year. I would like to see Cam Newton with maybe some type of targets. Even though Cam Newton is washed, he can't even throw. When he throws the ball, literally, he throws it into the dirt. I mean, I'm not saying I can do any better, but he's a professional athlete and I'm not. I'm just a talking head. But I can tell you this for absolute certainty that the Patriots are going to be better than they were last year, this year, no question. Bill Belichick's on a mission. I really hope that they're good. And the end of the day, like, it's all about beating Tom Brady. That's all Bill Belichick cares about. I don't care what anyone says. Bill Belichick and Tom Brady are, are wired the absolute same. They are, oh, oh, you don't believe in me? Boom. Oh, you don't think I could do this? Boom. Oh, you don't want to get me the right people. I'm going to leave. I'm going to win. Boom. Oh, you won the Super Bowl and you think you're better than me? Boom. I am so excited now for the Patriots because like, I know I'm a spoiled fan. I don't care. Call me whatever you want. But like last year was horrible. They were so bad last year. I know that other teams have never won ever, but like you still got the greatest coach ever. They should have been much better than they were last year. If anything, they had the most opt-outs. We all know that that was the situation. But overall, do I like the Patriots signing a bunch of people? Yes. It's, it's a good thing. No question. It's really fun. I love it. But I won't lie. It does look a little reactive. I'm not going to lie. When was the last time Bill Belichick signed like this in the free agency? I, I don't think it's ever been a time. Something else that I didn't mention, they had unbelievable cap flexibility last year because they made so many moves and guys didn't re-sign. And I think they have the most cap room. They made a big splash, brought in all these guys to make them really formidable this year. And honestly, before free agency, the Patriots were the third best team in the AFC, legitimately. And I'm not sure where they are now. Maybe talent-wise, they're top two or something. But I still think the Bills and the Dolphins are better because the Patriots don't have a quarterback. Cam Newton 
it's just washed. I'm sorry, he just is. But I do like Cam Newton, and I do think potentially a lot of these guys wanted to play with Cam Newton. So that's a draw. That's good. So I'm hopeful the Patriots will draft a quarterback. If the Patriots draft a quarterback, oh my God, this is the best free agency in my life. I've always wanted the Patriots to be big spenders in free agency. First day every year, I'm like, oh, I want them to sign. But everyone in Boston's like, you know, the Jets, all these stupid franchises are selling Brady their wins on March 15th. We do it in February at the Super Bowl. Blah, 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 blah. I want them to do both. I want them to sign everyone. I want them to do everything. I want to be on top of the market. I want it to be fun and win the Super Bowl, which is probably not possible because usually when you overpay on the first day of free agency, you don't do that. But, ah, oh, I'm happy. Now I can go on my day, my merry way, and pretend like the Patriots were the way they used to be with Tom Brady. Ah, I feel good today. That's it, guys. So I appreciate it. If you made it this far, make sure you subscribe down below. Leave a comment. Leave a like. Do everything you guys normally do. And tell your friends. Tell your family. Because we're posting every day coming up. So I appreciate it. Talk to you guys soon.